First at 10 tonight, seven elected officials are asking President Joe Biden for help for the Commonwealth, sending a bipartisan letter to the White House today asking for federal aid after Debbie tore through the state. Good evening, I'm Ann Lurie Aaron has the night off. The letter comes after Governor Shapiro requested a major disaster declaration earlier this month. Our Jake Sarwar joins us live now with the latest. Jake. Yeah, and if the declaration is approved, Pennsylvanians will be able to help cover some of their expenses and other necessities as they continue to recover from those storms that came through earlier this month. At the beginning of August, Tropical Storm Debbie tore through parts of northeastern and central Pennsylvania, leaving many to pick up the pieces. Following the storm, Governor Josh Shapiro issued a disaster emergency proclamation, which included 28 counties that were under flash flood warnings and experienced heavy rain. The proclamation states that it would make $5 million of state funding immediately available to assist with immediate response and recovery and authorize state agencies to use all available resources and personnel as necessary. In a bipartisan and bicameral effort to receive funding, members of Congress are calling on President Biden to step in to help. Congresswoman Susan Wild, Senator John Fetterman, Congresswoman Madeline Dean, Congresswoman Chrissy Houlihan, Congressman G.T. Thompson, Senator Bob Casey, and Congressman Cartwright urged the president to act swiftly to approve the governor's request. In a statement sent to Fox 56, Congressman Cartwright writes in part, Every single county in Pennsylvania's 8th Congressional experienced damage as a result of Tropical Storm Debbie moving through our region. The lawmakers believe individual assistance from the federal government is crucial to help homeowners cover uninsured and underinsured expenses. I reached out to Congressman G.T. Thompson, who represents parts of central Pennsylvania that were impacted, who said in part, the Biden-Harris administration must not delay. Those affected by Tropical Storm Debbie need access to the resources a disaster designation will bring. My office continues to work with families and localities impacted. The lawmaker's request comes after FEMA denied the Commonwealth's appeal for disaster funding following severe flash flooding nearly a year ago in Luzerne, Lackawanna, and Wyoming counties. Now, the most flooding that was reported throughout the area with damage was actually in the Cowanes River in Tioga County, according to the National Weather Service. Reporting live tonight in Master Control, I'm Jake Sarwar, Fox 56 News, First at 10.